Hello everyone. Today, we're going to work through an exciting problem from the International Mathematical Olympiad, or IMO, from the year 2001. Here's the problem. Let A, B, and C be positive numbers. We need to prove the following inequality. A divided by the square root of A squared plus 8 times B times C plus B divided by the square root of B squared plus 8 times C times A plus C divided by the square root of C squared plus 8 times A times B is greater than or equal to 1. We will use some algebra and the AMGM inequality to solve it. First, let's remind ourselves of the AMGM inequality. For any set of non-negative numbers x1, x2, and so on, up to xn, the arithmetic mean is greater than or equal to the geometric mean. Equality holds only when all the numbers are equal. We'll use this inequality to simplify and prove our result. Our goal is to simplify the left-hand side of the inequality by applying the AMGM inequality. We'll first show that for each term, we can write a divided by the square root of a squared plus 8 times b times c is greater than or equal to a to the power of 4 thirds divided by the sum of a to the power of 4 thirds plus b to the power of 4 thirds plus c to the power of 4 thirds. This holds for the terms involving b and c as well. Adding up all these results will help us prove the inequality. Let's now expand the following expression x plus y plus c, all squared. This expands to x squared plus y squared plus c squared plus 2 times xy plus 2 times yz plus 2 times zx. Except for x squared, we can now apply the AMGM inequality to these eight terms. When we apply the AMGM inequality to the eight terms, we get y squared plus c squared plus two times xy plus two times yz plus two times zx is greater than or equal to eight times the product of x to the power of one half, y to the power of three quarters, and z to the power of three quarters. This step is key to simplifying the overall expression. Next, let's define new variables. Let x equal a to the power of 4 thirds, y equal b to the power of 4 thirds, and z equal c to the power of 4 thirds. This gives us the following inequality. a divided by the square root of a squared plus 8 times b times c is greater than or equal to a to the power of 4 thirds divided by the sum of a to the power of 4 thirds plus b to the power of 4 thirds plus c to the power of 4 thirds. We do the same for the terms involving b and c.
When we add these three inequalities, we get a divided by the square root of a squared plus eight times b times c plus b divided by the square root of b squared plus eight times c times a plus c divided by the square root of c squared plus eight times a times b is greater than or equal to one. Hence, we have proven that the original inequality holds. In conclusion, we've shown that the given inequality is true by applying the AMGM inequality and using algebraic manipulations. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this explanation of the AMGM inequality and its application to this problem helpful. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe for more math content. See you next time.